What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for watching and subscribing. We've got a great video for you guys today. We're going to go over the 10 best apps to help you make more money while you drive. There are a lot of great ways to actually significantly increase your income besides just the rides you give and the tips you get. So we're going to go over all of these in this video. Before we jump in, we wanted to give a quick shout out to our sponsor, Solo. Solo is the best way for drivers to simply make more money while they're on the road. It gets you guaranteed pay, and on top of that, there is a ton of other features inside this app, including tracking, which is also a very, very helpful feature. Our viewers are going to get $10 just for signing up using the link in the description below. So make sure you check that out, guys, and let's dive in. All righty. So the number one app that I think all drivers should be using is Solo, as we just talked about. This is an incredible app, and for all the reasons I said that I'm not going to go back into, Solo is a must-have at this point. Out of everything I've ever used on the road, Solo has gotten me the most actual money. Um, everything is pretty solid, but this is the most useful and gets you paid the most. Uh, the next on the list is Get Upside. Get Upside is going to show you certain gas stations where you can actually get savings on your gas. I drive a diesel vehicle, and for me, the savings have always been incredible. A lot of times, I can get 20 to 30 cents off per gallon just by filling up at a certain gas station. It's not as high for normal cars, but still pretty well worth it. A lot of times, you can get five cents off per gallon just by going to a gas station across the street from the one that you might have gone to. Uh, number three is Play Octopus. Play Octopus is also another phenomenal app. Uh, they send you a tablet for free. You attach it to your headrest. It has games on it that passengers can play. Uh, they can win prizes for playing, like Amazon gift cards, and you get paid just from them playing the games. It's great for entertainment purposes as well, and Play Octopus has said that they've proven their drivers actually make more from tips and have higher overall driver ratings just from having that free tablet in their vehicle. They also pay for the data too, so it's not like you'd have to pay for the data for it. Uh, next up is Stride Tax. This is a great way to just have your miles tracked for you. The app runs in the background while you drive and does all your tracking. Another one that I think is very underrated is Fetch. I still to this day use Fetch. Essentially, you're just going to scan your receipts and get cashback rewards for those. Uh, so I do it with literally anything I buy. Uh, if it's just a Walmart run, if it's gas, I'm always taking a picture of that receipt. And the big thing is with gas is you want to find multiple ways to take that cost down as far as you can. So obviously, get upside is one. Um, combining it with getting some cashback incentive by using Fetch to scan the receipt. And then on top of that, leading right into our next one is Gas Buddy. Gas Buddy is going to show you essentially the cheapest gas stations near you. So if you use Gas Buddy and then you pull the Get Upside app out to see if there's a promotion at one of these cheaper gas stations, you're really going to get some good savings. Then you scan that receipt and you're getting an incentive back there. You're really doing well. Um, another really, really powerful one is flight stats. That's going to show you essentially what flights are landing at the airports near you. This is one that's really, really powerful for weekday driving. I really, really enjoy this because I know when some of those busier flights are going to land and if I should start heading to the airport. Uh, if it's a slower weekday, I a lot of times check it to see if there's any action coming in that's going to be worthwhile. Then you check the queue to see where you know the line is at and if it's not too busy and you see a pretty big flight landing soon it's a great way to just make some easy money during the week now another one that i think is very underrated is the rider apps i used these religiously mainly when i first started driving uber and lyft it was just an idea i had to see if you know i was in a congested area it's really, really good, again, for slower times. If you can't figure out why you're not getting a ride, pull up the app, the rider apps, and you might not be too shocked to see that there's a lot of drivers in your area just sitting and waiting. And the next one on the list is Sweatcoin. This one won't work while you're driving, but it just tracks your steps as you walk around and you slowly build that up. My Sweatcoin is still really active. I have almost 
4,000 sweat coins that I can cash in for rewards right now. Now you obviously got to really build that up before you get anything really nice. But what I really like is they have a lot of stuff you can buy by essentially you get a discount by applying X amount of sweat coins, if that makes sense. So there might be something that I would normally be about to buy anyways, and if I can check and it's on there, I can get a discount that obviously I wouldn't get in store or just buying it online. And if you save up enough, they have some pretty crazy rewards like new iPhones or just thousand dollar gift cards somewhere. But like I said, that does take a long time. And the last one on our list, number 10, is Survey Junkie. I used this so much when I first started driving. In between rides, slow times, rather than just scrolling through Instagram, I would fill out some surveys and slowly build that up as well. You can also find some pretty unique apps uh, that are looking for rideshare drivers specifically for surveys. And for a while, um, I would capitalize on all of those and really increase my earnings each month. So anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like, share, comment, subscribe. I'll leave links in the description for all of these so that you guys can check them out. Definitely look into Solo. You'll get 10 bucks just for signing up for free. Hope you guys enjoyed it and stay tuned for more updates.